by 2050, there's going to be more plastic than fish in terms of weight in the ocean. We consume up to five grams of microplastics every month, which is quite scary, like a credit card of plastic every month. Seaweed is this amazing material. One of the solutions we have for many different applications. We really believe that could be a, a really good resource for the future. I'm Rodrigo Garcia. I'm originally from Spain, but I live and work in London. I'm the co-founder and co-CEO of Lotla, a company with the mission of making plastic packaging disappear. We are a combination of entrepreneurs, scientists, designers, researchers, all with the same mission. We just wanted to have a product with impact. It's a seaweed-based membrane that can contain water or any liquid. You can drink the content, and then you can eat the membrane. It had been used in things like the London Marathon, Roland Garros, or music festivals. We have some vending machines as well across London where you can get hydration without plastic. Then we started to work with coatings. So basically we apply a seaweed-based coating into paper and cardboard in order to provide greaseproof and waterproof for certain applications as takeaway boxes. So seaweed is a, it's a really sustainable resource because you don't need fertilizer, you don't need fresh water, and you don't compete with other food crops. You can grow it really fast. So we had invested, for example, in a local farm in Wales for some uh, research purpose. We grow various species on the farms, sugar kelp, wing kelp, and all weed. They normally are the ones that's quite high in demand and it's quite uh, versatile in various sort of products that you can make with them. The relationship with Notpla started very close to two years ago. For a company that's so futuristic in their thinking and the product that they're developing, for them to have invested in us in the very early stages was humbling, motivating and inspiring. So within the next six months, we'll be harvesting nearly 50 tons worth of seaweed. And we will be able to provide them with, hopefully, all the seaweed that they would possibly need. We measure our impact by the number of plastic items that we are able to replace. I think at the moment we passed the million mark, which is quite exciting. We hope that we can increase this number by going deeper in terms of the applications that we currently have, but expanding geographically and in terms of different type of plastic packaging that we can replace. <laughs>